Oh man, let's see if he can before he gets another flight. Oh boy, he's going in the flight. Hit number two shots. Oh, babe. Uh-oh, this love is going to come out for me. Oh my god, he's out of us. He's out of us. Can we take him down? Oh, we get the rope. Roger, 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 roger. <laughs> Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatever time it is in your neck of the woods. This is Tony, and welcome to today's video. So today we've got a giveaway for the brand new hazard weapons. I almost forgot to post it. The official rules are like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on that bell notification. Select all so you guys never miss a thing. To enter and put your pilot ID platform and hashtag WRWinHazard into the comment section of any of my content. Atop the screen right now is an example of what the pilot ID and platform looks like. For those of you who do not know, winners will be posted in my Discord and will include them in my community tab on YouTube or most likely in a YouTube video. A reminder that the giveaway does end on the 27th, so you only got about a day or two, so get your entries in. As you can see, we're trying these hazards out on the Typhon right now. On this setup, I was using healing with the beak drone. I had one nuclear amp and two repair amplifiers on there. Um, I was using advanced repair, like I said, but I think I want to try this again with shield breaker. I think shield breaker will really b bring this build to life and make it shine like none other. The number one problem right now while running these weapons is running into those purple absorber shields in those yellow Aegis shields. Those things are going to be popping up and absorbing all of your damage. Um, so that's why I think running shield breaker on this bad boy is really, really, really going to make it shine. I'm going to test it out after making this video and then I'm going to let you guys know. Also, we have a 200 decay giveaway going on right now until the end of the month. I'll put the link up there and the instructions. Hashtag Tony 200 DK along with your pilot ID and platform to be entered. You can enter on that video that I posted in every single video I post until the end of this month. I will post the winners on my Discord and on YouTube as well. So we are trying to establish our dominance, establish control on top of this broken down dreadnought map with our hazard typhon. Boom, we get the double kill right there. Very, very nice. Um, this map is kind of tough. You really don't have a lot of lines of sight because there's so many obstruction. There's so many different pieces of cover in the center. Um, you really need to try to get on top of this roof if you're going to be running any type of range build on this map and you want to be successful. This is a really fun spot. Um, sometimes you could really make some crazy stuff happen up here when you're playing range builds. Uh, but as soon as people figure out you're up there, they're going to be gunning for you. Like these guys, they are coming for me right now. I can feel it. <laughs> I can see it too. All right, let's see if we can get a nice angle on these guys some way, somehow. Let's see if we can get sneak this in. Bop. Oh, it just hit that little lip right there. Darn it. All right, let's see if we can drop this guy down as we're falling. He goes into his phase shift right now. Oh, he gets another flight. Tons of harpies, tons of sirens out there on the battlefield right now. Ooh, see that? Purple shield absorbing those shots, and that's exactly what I'm talking about. You're going to be dealing with so many shields out here. It's, it's going to be really hard for you to get your damage through. Um, I can't wait to actually try the shield breaker. I'm really excited now. Now I'm talking about it. I'm really excited to try it out. I'm really hoping it's going to uh, be pretty good here. All right, backing on up. This Revenant's getting all up in our face. Like can't amaze. Boom, we get the Rampage, Rampage, Rampage. Man, I'm surprised, man. We were able to get out of a couple sticky situations with this thing, but it's just a test to to how great of a robot the Titan is. If you don't encounter Sirens and Harpies with the Shield Breaking Pilot on there, you're going to be in for a great, great time. Great, great time. But if you do run into it or if you run into a Fafnir with shield breaker you are going to be in trouble because the base hp on the hull of the typhon is not that big so you can get taken down very very quickly so you have to be very careful now we're coming in with the demeter demeter is an awesome little robot i've been having a ton of fun with this thing lately i haven't played it in a really long time up until a few weeks ago when on Adrian's stream we did like a Vox squad with Demeters and um, I really really fell in love with it again man I've been having so much fun with it and I find it super useful towards endgame when you have all the blinding titans out there I don't know about you guys but in my matches 
the end of them are dominated by mirror mets mings with blinders four five six every single match guaranteed blinding me up from 600 meters this thing blocks that so i really like to save this for the tyson titan portion of the match um it really really shines man you could push up you could block all that damage even from the new gargantua pants of you could block that damage as well uh very very fun very very effective on my demeter i prefer to run the app meter uh, i know with the jerry you get a little bit additional damage but the app meter you get to heal up that great damage which is to me in my opinion an invaluable tool uh being able to extend your life uh, when you otherwise couldn't is kind of amazing the only other thing you could really do it in the game is the marie pilot on the mender which is another amazing awesome pilot oh boy oh boy oh boy see look at this look at this look at this we got some titans back here we're backing on off backing on up oh my gosh mirror mets in the sky at least they don't got blinders this guy does i can tell i can see his blinders going off Ooh. What do you guys think? Do you think the Gargantua Pantagruel are super OP, or do you guys think the blinding weapons are stronger? Let me know down in the comments section. Drop it to me. Tell me. I want to hear your guys' opinion on the matter. To me, the blinders have 100 extra meters range. They have the blinding effect. Uh, the Gargantua Pantagruel, they don't do a tremendous amount of damage to a single target. But when they hit multiple targets at a time, that's when the damage output can get kind of crazy. Uh, but if you're in like a 1v1 with it, more than not, a lot of the times you could uh, withstand and survive it. Alright, we're going to be dropping with the Kepri right now. Because they have their beer mets in the back with those new vacuum weapons, I want to be able to take him out. Um, I know with this robot, it's super durable, super tanky, so I'll be able to withstand a little bit to take, take him down. All right, let's see if we can move on up here. Move on up. Let's get up in this guy's face. We can't amaze. Blasting away. Get within his shield. Bop, 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 bop. Double kill. That's what I'm talking about. Um, oh, you know, all the shields and everything in the game. I know a lot of people complain about the shields. And when I'm trying to play ranged builds, I can tell that's when it's a, a problem to me. But I mostly brawl. Like, I, you know, I like shotguns, flames, things where you get up in their face and uh, brawl close range so shields really don't make that huge of a difference to me it's only when i run range stuff like in the beginning of the match when i was running that hazard typhon i was encountering a lot of the shields and it was it was tough but with this i just get real close to them i get within their shield and the shield isn't a problem at all to me all right let's see if we can take this guy down nice we get the triple kill and the rumpadre we are getting it in over here all right, let's see if we can take this shell out, blasting away right through his physical shield. We are on a godlike already. All right, all right, all right. Come on, baby. Ooh, blasting away at this Titan. Can we take him down? Oh, man, teammate steals it. And that is going to be the game, ladies and gentlemen. Let's take a look at the scoreboard and see what we're working with here. Hmm... 6.8 16 kills not too shabby appreciate you guys so much hope everybody has a great day and keep coming back